Hello and welcome back once again, my friends. Habage here, and delighted that you decided to stop by. Hope we've uh, got some more. Oh, 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 almost did the disaster. Don't do that. Clicked over to the window before I had it closed. All right. Double check. Checking the time. We're going to be just ahead of the bottom of the hour when we're time to wrap up. Rainbow Turtle. Nothing sounds more... Oh, makes me think more of Hawaii. Um, I don't know if they... Anybody know if the University of Hawaii is still the Rainbow Warriors? I think that's what they they were. That may have changed years ago. And then the... Uh, of course, the turtle. If you've uh, if you've ever been there, it's so iconic. A lot of the uh, you know uh, t-shirts and and all that kind of stuff. You see a lot of I see a lot of cars even here in Colorado that have the uh, sea turtle logo on the the windows kind of stuff. So very cool to see all that. Uh, anyway, that's random. Thanks, Minecraft. Um, what are we gonna do? I would like to find those diamonds, and I don't know exactly what shape that's going to take, but I think that for this one, we're bringing along Mr. Diamond Delight. We're also going to... Hopefully get those done. Is there anything we can do in the next few minutes here? Um, I think we're so... Oh, we should maybe do one there. Got the one there. Well, now. That's a little concerning. We just left that open. Ahead and drop some light out here. Those won't be visible from outside, which is nice, um, but should help keep some mobs from spawning, which could then walk right in the open door I left. Close that up. Uh, I haven't done much with this room yet, but again, I'm thinking. Um, Maybe we do our enchanting up on this level, and then we'll have one more level where we'll bring back over to here and do the mirrored staircase again. And up above this level, we'll do you know just the tighter room because again, we can pull this one back to here. It would be I think uh, with another stepped up uh, kind of angled roof, and then just have a, a glass observation -y type top so looking forward to getting all of that going eventually Not too soon put those away for now we've got uh got a couple more we can probably get some substantial progress going on our other posts you know get get this side done or the other whatever but not as important as our diamonds um, I did, uh, finally check the mechanics on the spawners, and the skelly spawner, or any of them, are only going to be active when we're within 16 blocks of the, uh, spawner itself, and... That was here. We know this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So we got a little ways to go uh, before we really get to where we're spawning while we're working. So that's why we haven't had just an overwhelming flood of zombies around. Zombies. Uh, skeletons to clean up. Uh, 
that's okay. This is kind of a dead end. This is why I decided to bring along the, um, the good pick, because if we kind of wander away rather than just bashing through more uh, of our basement, which is, isn't a terrible way to go about finding uh, more diamonds dirt up there but we did that last time and I think maybe stretching our legs a bit here would be good now we've done some exploration out in these caves but it's some of this kind of stuff that may open up new possibilities for us. Oh, oh uh, pretty handy having that bow, huh? Thank you, our friendly skeletons. Uh, that's... Oh! Hey. Very, very bad on me. Uh, gotta be aware that there's a huge ravine up above our heads. Uh, nothing too diamondy though. And then this comes back the way it had been, maybe. Let's get these gold. We are going to need to go for more apples, too. I think we're maybe out. Not out close to it. Let's just see if this gravel is... Oh, it is connected to other stuff, but... Oh, is that just the way we came up into this cave? Shh. Okay, but I was hearing that skeleton. I don't know where that was coming from exactly. Thing we need to watch out for here is any trouble dropping from the hole. I still don't know where that skeleton is. commit to a big 
dig project when you only have one shovel. Tips to live by. Oh, I hear you all walking around. I don't know. Oh, this looks like some kind of potential fun. Definitely intimidating to get up to. Ooh, uh, okay. Doing this knowing that there was a creeper right over here. There he is. find out that there's another creeper. Yeah, doesn't he had too many friends. It's tough when it's kind of Edward Scissorhands kind of deal. Can't get too close to anybody. King Midas. Right? Only touch turns to gold, so don't touch the people you care about. Um... Problem with all this, it's fun to explore, but it's way too high up for diamonds. Oh, this wouldn't be though. That's where excitement can get the better. fairly solid. I think that probably connects into the other one that was up above uh, some of the parts of the mine shaft. Did 
definitely make some time for all this gold. So my understanding at least is that gold does not get the same fortune boost that iron and copper do. Feel free to uh, comment if I'm completely off base there. Not that I would use our limited gold pick uh, so frivolously when we're using it for saving it for diamonds. But knowing is half the battle. So said G.I. Joe when I was a kid. Sounds plenty active down here, doesn't it? Up down is the one thing that's really tough to This does feel kind of silly <laughs> when we've got a whole basement starting on level 11. Uh, somewhere back in the negative 1700? It's like, what, like negative 1726, negative 1726 are really close to each other? Something like that. Uh, here, here. This is 12. Interesting. So if we went like this, we might, in theory, get back towards <laughs> running into our mine or something. Go ahead and get rid of that. Probably what we should have been doing all along in this episode. But a little more efficient to start it from wherever your basement is. <laughs> so it's convenient. But who wants to do that? run into our skelly spawner. How bad would that be? Good thing this would be is that we'd be far up above it. So as long as we didn't just 
run off the edge and in, we'd be okay. And you could just seal up the hole, go around it. Not diamonds, but proto diamonds. Right. If it wasn't for us coming along and snatching these up, give them a few million years, they could become diamonds. You never know. I got a sip here. Time out. We may have uh, had a little trouble locating the source of some of those sounds because I had the headset on backwards. It makes location a little tough. Ooh. Also didn't know we... Have we not been getting coal at all? How much coal have we wasted? Team? all that. Lots of lava sounds. Now I can correctly guess that those are off to the right. somewhere. Oh, hey. This helps. See? Get some landmarks. And we... Uh, do we have trash? Nothing too pure trash. <sighs> So aggravating. For now, I, I I can see why there may have been a change. I I haven't looked at anything or anything like that, but you know, as time goes by, it it does make sense. It prevents accidental loss of stuff, and I'm sure you know <laughs> it may be rare, but I'm sure little Timmy's mom has written more than one angry letter to. Uh, Microsoft Mojang about how Timmy Timmy was playing this awful game that he thought was really really fun until the thing that he'd worked on so hard um, fell into the lava because he closed his inventory at the wrong time you know that kind of stuff it it happens you know it's best interest and all that but it does seem rather inefficient means of protecting inventory or at least it cancels out a, a very efficient means of managing your inventory just as a safeguard you know it's when does uh when does safety at the expense of efficiency become a little too much, right? How are we doing there? Do we have apples? We have no apples. Do we want to go on an apple run? Um... Maybe just mix it up a little bit, see if we can reset our diamond luck. What do you guys think? 
or do we just go suck it up and start going directionally underground? Honestly, I think I think we need to stick on this diamond hunt. We got 13 apples until we until we're in like the Nether. We really shouldn't need that many. You know, we've got enough to feel kind of good about things. So I think no immediate sidetrack for apples. We'll cook the gold. We'll have it ready. That will be. Incentive. Um, you know what I think it's time for, though. Let's use that to restock. Go ahead and get a few more furnaces going. Uh, I still never figured out what the smelter blast furnace is. Blast furnace, right? Smoker, smithing. Um, Got to be some dumb thing that we're missing, right? But we've already had stone now. Is it the smooth stone? Do we have to cook... Double cook some cobble? Let's try that. We got lots of cobble. I don't know why we needed two. We're going to use this to... That. Those away. through to the ceiling. Ooh, we were already ahead there. One more. And we'll have our inside copper done. <laughs> we just gotta get the zillion or so uh, coppers to do our outside copper and we'll be good to go. Okay, random torches. I don't think we're gonna go. Well, let's take these down and just leave them down there. And then we can. Blast off from our so far basement area. All right. So all that's done and good. This is a torch line. I have no idea. I guess I can figure it out. So we're going north. This would be back into the hillside and away from our the opposite direction of our boat entrance, which I guess is 
blatantly obvious if we look back towards the stairs going up there. Sometimes it's easy to overcomplicate things. episode we've we've danced around it long enough we need some diamonds so we're looking to you As we do this next little section, I'm going to lift the mic. Alright, thank you for affording me that opportunity to finish up the last of my coffee. It's very welcome. <laughs> Nothing yet. Uh, we need some crazy incantations or something to summon the power of the diamondos. goodies, not uh, quite as exciting as we'd like. Flowing water, always potentially interesting. So far we haven't seen any kind of ocean or anything back in that direction. We had it's kind of the least explored of any, not that we've exhaustively checked out any direction, but it's kind of the one where we haven't reached an ocean of any kind. And again, until we get some respiration, we got to remind ourselves that aquatics are not our forte. Come on, show me that sweet blue. I don't know if that was one, two, three, four. Oh, it was. Okay. Thought maybe the deep slate had thrown off my count. I think I'm more okay with clearing the deep slate when we're working like on the basement or the build, the build of any kind than I am when I'm trying to t 
tunnel. Then I feel the delay more. <laughs> kind of, you know, you get in this tunnel mode and you're like, I want to see more. Come on, let's go. Um, and so I think, you know, if the goal is to make it a noticeable difference, kudos in the uh, the branch mining, you know, this kind of technique. He definitely got us feeling it here. I know usually we're going to bypass most everything, but for now at least copper is you know, scarce and uh, helpful. Alright, what do we got here? Hope that's the diamond sound. It's the coal sound. Take that. Gold. We don't want to go up. We want to go down. At least stay level. Ooh, that's down. It's just a higher ceiling. Come on. Something down this way would be nice. Anything hiding under the water? Back to <laughs> back to threat assessment, not just wandering in the cave. Could get dangerous. See now that's what I'm talking about. What do you got for me down here, game? Feels like a lull too. Like, oh yeah, don't don't worry. It's safe and peaceful here in this hardcore cave in the depths. You don't need to worry about that creeper coming. Copper check. Height check. 19 or too high already. Yeah, that's enough of that. Down here, still nothing. Um, but let's. <sighs> no. That won't do it. You know how long, I mean, clearly I gripe about it every episode. You know how long it's going to take to unlearn something that I've been doing for, I don't know, a decade as a keystroke? Uh, I'm, sure, I'm sure some point tough will be necessary, but... Why, why, why did you make it so difficult? 
to clear stuff. I don't understand. Alright, here's this. Scary up there. So up above footsteps. All right. They all seem to come in threes these days. I don't know if that was a deal. But it's a behavior I've noticed. Spiders. I saw a creeper back there creeping. And with this bat, I can guarantee we're going to have one shot that doesn't count. seemed mini zombie here is shuffling little feet where are you mini well maybe that was spider feet ooh Interested up here because. Hey, ooh, does he have a punch bow? Should really eat something here, huh? Before we get in too much trouble. Get him. <laughs> uh, what? You holding that up with your head, pal? That was an extended sizzle. That's the one we want to go down, I think. But... First... Take care of the death from above. More coal.
Is that a bat noise? A loud bat. Ooh. Huh. Well, that's just a hole. Very angly hole, but a hole. And no diamonds, of course. I think we can exit back from here, though. Oh, hi, buddy. Hey. That, you're gonna get yourself killed. Told him. I tried, tried to warn the bat. But at least it wasn't just me. The skeleton got him first, so. Ooh. Hey, I was dodging. You know it, and I know it. Lots of gold. Coal and all this would be very nice, but... I kind of like to do as much exploring as we can. Again, I think we've... We always seem to drift up above where... We're going to get our diamonds. Okay, that's all. Well, you know how I was saying that we didn't want to rush to pick up too much coal? <laughs> yeah, now that we have no torches, it seems like a pretty good idea. Just kind of hoping that one of these pushes up against some diamonds. Was the uh, that's the other side of the game karma for having given us such a good pick. <laughs> it's like, yep, uh, it's kind of one of those backhanded gifts. We're gonna give it to you and tease you with how many diamonds you can have, but uh, in exchange, the map editor has just run in the background and removed 85% of the diamond nodes that would have been here. torches. Oh, hey. Oh, boy. Uh... Oh, there was a creeper, too. Come on. Oh! Uh... 
This is fun. All right. Here it is. We we get vindication in our episode. So we got to be very careful. And what am I doing? I said... We weren't going to do anything but fully expose the deposit. Although I think three is probably as many as we'll get here because it's exposed in a cave already. Usually, um, when they're visible like that, you don't get the huge pockets like you would if you're just exploring underground. Yeah, so this looks like just some surface. Here I'm just making sure no crazy lava or anything like that to surprise us. All right, here we go. So three, we want to see how lucky we get with our super awesome pick. Uh, nothing here really worthy of a screenshot. It's way too dark. Uh, huh? Have you ever had a moment in a game when you just want to cry? We're, uh... <laughs> we're kind of at that moment. Ah! <laughs> I want to cry. Gold can't break diamond. Or it can break it just can't obtain it when it does so we just wasted one and we get no awesome fortune on our awesome diamond stupid pick oh man how many of you guys were watching for two episodes until that amazing revelation hit so let's do a little for sciencing here Do we get... Oh, we get nothing out of that? I hope at least we get coal. What good is a fortune pick that doesn't break anything good? Ugh. Forty-seven? At least we get some coal. I think. 50. All right. You are a new coal. What was it? Like the diamond delight pick or something like that? Man. Oh, I'm so dumb. Oh, I don't have a torch. <sighs> that goes back down to the lava. Now we got to try to find our way home. I'm way too flustered by the devastation. I know we're not going to be able to get lapis. Can't get iron, I bet, since we can't get copper. Oh. <laughs> just, it never even occurred to me. Oh, yeah. The gold won't actually pick up the diamonds. It'll be fortune three nothing. Uh, oh, <laughs> now I'm not using it. But the good news is, look at it. We're not uh, not even going to have to go take it down to the skeletons because of the mending. Question is, keep an eye on that, that 34 XP bar. And let's see if it goes up at all. All. Are we getting a trickle of XP or nothing? Oh, man. <laughs> I am so smart. S-M-R-T. I mean, S-M-A-R-T. Oh. 
<laughs> All right, so we came in. Uh, clearly wasn't from there, was it? Is there a hole somewhere down here that I'm missing? That was just the coal we pulled out. Here. Here? Yeah. And, yeah, we just pulled that coal. All right. Jeez. So we have a coal pick that I misnamed a diamond pick. Ah, stop it. And we're running out of room, so we're going to have to switch out some trash. Maybe the string. We've got lots of string. spider eyes yet. Let's put that away. The bones have too much to use. We don't need the gravel, really. we got a whole gravelly mountain nearby. Um, yeah, let's call that good for now. Okay, so this should be a good test, because now I'm not sure... We've got three... Six. All right, so the deep slate and the regular stone coal seem to work about the same. Well, this is good. <laughs> it's deep, but uh, can I get down into it? Such a tease. Well, I've said before, I've eaten plenty of humble pie and deaths to learn stuff. I don't think I'm going to forget this lesson anytime too soon. Although I think I've probably learned it in the past. Uh, it's just so rare that you end up with a gold tool that you actually want to use. Um, man, I can't see anything. I don't have any torches. Nope. Sorry if this is really dark for you guys. How are we doing? Uh, <laughs> getting pretty full here. We can always trade out this flint. Okay, and that's our... I hadn't even looked at the 34 level again. Clearly we're pulling some of that XP back. And we'll just seal that off. Nice little mob factory. Uh, don't have much iron. Trappy. Not, but felt it. Oh, still got these to go. Got excited about the gold. 32 pieces of gold. Very nice. <laughs> I 
dun, 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 dun. So we should be right at about an hour right now. We got lots of room for coal still. Not even counting our... Flint Swaparoo. Counting our Flint Swaparoo. Oh, is a garbage truck down? I hear a truck outside. This would actually be ideal if it was. Doesn't exactly sound like it. Um, but considering we're close to wrapping up this episode, we're already at or around an hour and uh, full and right almost back to the base. So bring on the noise if it's coming. All right, well, guys, we got a heck of a cool pick. <laughs> I'm so glad I made that into a thumbnail and posted it. It's probably like the bait of the whole internet now. Everybody's like, oh, yeah, look at this Minecraft stream. I don't even know gold doesn't break diamonds. <laughs> um, all you guys coming in here to laugh first of all thanks for showing up i appreciate you being here we have a lot of fun and uh, we definitely do dumb stuff like that all the time it's hardcore and uh as you guys have probably heard if you've stuck around this long um we learn by <laughs> making the mistakes so we'll just keep those coming here so we keep getting a little wiser for next time uh we did you know aside from the one diamond we just straight up broke we got a couple more uh those are going to go into tool production here pretty quick um hang on one second i don't think i can hold the sneeze until the end of the episode maybe i can we're gonna try Unlike the last time, I'm going to try to get things squared away. I know we're already just a minute or two long. I apologize for that. Um, but... Uh, this was the one where we put the gold. Man, we got so much now. Uh, that stone is really throwing stuff off. Uh, let's blocks, split them into three. This is going to be our most used, I would guess. Got that. We've got more supply. So we're never going to have to worry about coal again. <laughs> That's nice. Uh, still got to worry about diamonds, though. Less nice. Um, got a bit of obsidian. We can make our diamond pick to go pop into the nether and I, I'm a little tempted but what I really hoped when I back when I foolishly thought we had a fortune three pick already set was we'd rack up so many diamonds that we could kind of trash them onto shovels willy-nilly and clear this out way faster and we still may do that <laughs> just um just out of the diamonds uh obviously we 
we want to make our one diamond pick. And before we do any, you know what? Let's let's commit. We need to save two, so we need those for our enchanting. We can then do one diamond pick. That's going to be to get our obsidian and get us to the nether. And let's go ahead and do three diamond shovels. Um, crazy, I know. Especially with all the luck we've had on diamonds. But uh, we're going to go with a little, uh, a little Minecraft karma here. And by showing that we're committed to stuff... Other than the advancements, hope that it will then go, oh yeah, all right, we taught you your lesson. Here's some more diamonds. Um, so I'm not going to carry around that diamond pick. For the moment... Let's try these new recipes. All right. Where is it? That was it, right? Is it a blast? <laughs> Furnace, iron, and smooth stone blocks. So, bleh. Let's. We're so long already, I know. Let's do this and this. Uh, and then it was iron. Bloom. Bloom. Oh, all right, they're here. <laughs> Everything is telling me it's time to wrap up. I'm wasting all kinds of time here. Um... We're going to set up a mini mini operation here, I think. Let's do... We'll figure it out next time. <laughs> the banging is enough. Save the world, stay inside, uh, get a vaccination, and then go outside and reacquaint yourself with the world. Um, yeah, you know, understand the circumstances. Be be smart about where you are, but uh, it's about that time we all, all get back into it. Anyhow, um... As I, I kind of joked about here, thank you all so much for watching. Whether you came to laugh at the foolish uh, Minecraft streamer that was running around with a gold pick to get diamonds, um, or you're just back and and you know kind of follow day to day to see what what other mistakes we can make, I appreciate you either way. And uh, I hope if you're new here, you uh, want to come back and check out some more. Now that we've uh, we've corrected our mistake, we're going to be the whole kings of the vanilla brewed coffee world and we're gonna set up those blast furnaces we'll have blocks upon blocks of coal and can cook up our copper and iron um just incredibly so we're gonna start cranking this up don't you worry uh but i think next time maybe we uh we start using those diamond uh, shovels and try to clear out a bunch of uh dirt from the immediate area so we can uh, get a little closer on the farming that's the plan anyway uh but for now i'm gonna take a break let these garbage trucks do their thing uh, go stretch my legs hydrate a little bit and uh, talk to you guys in just a little while take care bye now